Daniels Butler. And Henry Black Butler. And we're checking out WREG Media. Yeah, we want to give a shout out to Rug Media and my man for having us uh, do this interview and for showing us love all day long. We really appreciate Memphis and Rug Media. Holla. Hey, yo, Mike, check one, two, and two. It's definitely going down in a major way, man. I was with these wonderful people earlier. We was at Fox 13. Now we're here at Midnight Club, and we're ready to turn up. It's season three. It's Empire. I'm here with the casting director, Miss Leah Daniel Butlers, and a music mogul, somebody that, you know, I'm, I do music, so I, I know all about you. Mr. Henry Butler, how y'all doing this evening? Doing well, thank doing you for good, having me. good, man, thank you. Okay, so what y'all think about Memphis so far? Oh, I'm enjoying it, and I had Central Barbecue, and we went to the, um, uh, Stack Records Museum, and we went by the Lorraine Motel. We hit the corner and got some ribs. So let's jump right into it. You've been an amazing uh, casting director for many years, many films, television. What are some of the key things you're looking for when you're trying to discover talent? Um, I think the main thing is just truthfulness. You know, whenever we're looking for any role, you want the truth of that, of that character to come out. Okay. So how did the whole concept for Empire come about? Well, I, <laughs> we didn't really have, I didn't have play a part in the concept of it coming about. I think, um, you know, that's the show creator, but obviously there are some things that, you know, um, I think sort of parallel our lives and um, other people's lives as well. Okay. So, you know, music has went digital. You got online music, uh, computerized music now on MPCs and different things with computers. How is a, a, a music producer such as yourself be able to last so long in the business? Well, it's really based on relationships. And, you know, I was at the beginning of this thing, and, like, I watched a lot of people come up over the years, and, you know, I've always done good business. And, you know, because of that, you know, people continue to deal with me, and I keep getting referred to people at the people. So, right. you know, uh, keep a good name in the business, and you can continue to work, you know? The one thing I love about Memphis is how rich it is in music. When you think about people like Al Bell with Stax, 36 Mafia, those are some of the people that you work with over the years. Yeah, you know, it's funny uh, because today with my wife, she didn't realize how big and how instrumental Al Bell was to the music business until today when we went to the Stack Museum. And I said, babe, this is all Al. And I had one, of, Al gave me one of my first deals at Belmont Records. And I was there when he did Tag Team and uh, uh, with the 69 Boys and all that, you know. I was there when he done that, and just to, to go in there today and see the museum and see what he's doing and seeing what he's he's grown to is just like amazing to me. Just to, you know, knowing where he was and when I met him and where he is now, it's just it's, 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 it's crazy, you know. Okay. So, what advice would you give to an actor or actress that's maybe looking to get involved in television or movies? Training, <laughs> definitely training, because I think um, you know. With the, in the society that we kind of live in now, people are so quick to post like, quick videos and 15 second you know, Instagram or Snapchat videos, but nothing beats like good old fashioned change. What's up? So what advice would you give to an artist who's maybe trying to break into the business now? Be original. Stop copying off with Drake, Rihanna, and Beyonce. Don't be scared to step out and do, be original, sound original, and, and uh, believe in yourself. And make a hit record. Okay. You know a hit when you hear it. Oh yeah, most definitely. I got one more question for you. Analog or digital equipment? If you want that bottom, you better go to analog. But you know, digital is quick, so and affordable. Okay. Well, y'all heard it first right here. We're at the season three Empire premiere party with two greats in the industry, man. You definitely need to get at them. They're gonna give you some great advice, man. I'm definitely enjoying myself. I definitely appreciate y'all taking some time out with me.